<laughs> Harry Potter, Sorcerer's Stone. Let's go. English, please. No hable español. I did. I had, I had someone stop on my stream one time that asked if I nope. spoke Spanish, and I thought, fuck. Probably shouldn't skip that. But I did. Extras, fly control is normal, camera control is normal, vibration on, subtitles on, music, whatever, sound effects, speech. Yep, those are options are pretty standard. New game time. Told you, didn't I, Harry? Told you you was famous. Whoa, Professor whoa, whoa, Quirrell. whoa, 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 whoa. Harry, Professor Quirrell, this is not... No, 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 no. This is, should be where we start. Missing, uh... I play-tested this early. We're missing a, um... Some shit. I'll do this to me. Come on. I want the full Harry Potter fucking experience, guys. Come on. English, yes. Do I need to wait? Let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. WB. Harry Potter and all the related characters, the oldest trademark to and will be be entertained to incorporate Harry Potter. Blah, 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 blah. There was nothing about the starry sky that night to suggest that strange and mysterious things would soon be happening. There we go. Professor Dumbledore, sir. No problems, were there? No, sir. And now he's a baby in his hand. Destroyed. Just appears. But I got him out all right. Nestled in the bundle was a baby, Harry Potter, the boy who lived. Opposed to all those boys that didn't live. For the next 11 years, Harry lived with his dreadful aunt Petunia, Uncle Vernon, and cousin Dudley, the Dursleys. Then one day, he received a letter inviting him to attend Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. And okay, that's we did not miss much. We're gonna skip the whole, you know, his uncle, his aunt and uncle trying to move around and getting harassed by a bunch of fucking letters. Told you. Didn't I, Harry? Told you you was famous. No, no, you didn't. Professor Quirrell. Harry, Professor Quirrell will be one of your teachers at Hogwarts. Potter, I can't tell you how pleased I am to meet you. What sort of magic do you teach, Professor Quirrell? Oh, the dark arts. Defense against the dark arts. Not that you need it, eh, Potter? You'll be getting all your equipment, I suppose. I've got to pick up a new book on vampires myself. Must get on. Lots to buy. Come on, Harry. Do you ever... Do vampires ever come up in the books? I don't remember. Three up to a cross. Right. Stand back, Harry. Well, 
welcome to Diagon Alley. Just your wand left from Ollivanders. Oh yeah, and I still haven't got your birthday present. Hello? Good afternoon. Ah, yes. Yes, yes. I thought I'd be seeing you soon, Harry Potter. You have your mother's eyes. It seems only yesterday she was in here herself, buying her first one. And then Ten getting murdered. Inches long, swishing, made of willow. Nice one for charm work. Your father, on the other hand, favored a mahogany wand. Well, I say your father favored it. It's really the wand that chooses the wizard, of course. Well now, Mr. Potter, let's get started, shall we? If you'll kindly follow me. Walk, walk this way. Have a look around, Mr. Potter. When you find a wand you like, pick it up and let's see if it likes you. I'm glad that this game actually did kind of its own cutscenes, because I feel like a lot of video games from a movie adaptation just use cutscenes from the fucking movie. Uh, the flashing icon in the corner of your screen is your rim ball. Technically, Harry didn't get a rim ball. You can access that anytime by pressing the select button. When it flashes, it means you have a new task. You can check it out. Boom. Boom. Uh, let your wand choose you. Blah, blah, blah. Don't care. Let's see what we got Kippany here. and unicorn hair. Eight and a half inches. Springy. Let's see. What we got here? Holly and phoenix feather. Eleven inches. Nice and supple. That is... This, this is his wand right here. Because his wand has Holly a phoenix, phoenix feather, feather that the phoenix produced two inches. feathers rather than one. Nice and, and it was supple. unusual. Beech wooden dragon heartstring, nine inches, nice and flexible. Well, let's see what happens if I pick up the wrong wand. Stand over there on that platform to try your wand. Do -do -do. Press circle, try blah 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 to test the wand. Adabra Kadabra! My goodness, definitely not. Oh, now listen here, assholes. You're not gonna mix them up. Holly and Phoenix. There it is. Eleven inches. Nice and supple. Caruccio! Every wand I've ever sold, Mr. It's quite a burden on my mental Every state. Every single wand. It so happens that the phoenix, whose tail feather is in your wand, gave another feather. Just one other. It is very curious indeed that you should be destined for this one when it's brother. Its brother gave you that scar. Yes. Curious indeed how these things happen. The wand chooses the wizard, remember? I think we must expect great things from you, Mr. Potter. After all, he who must not be named did great things. Terrible, yes. But great. Please retrieve the spell book that lies beyond. It will prove most valuable in all that lies ahead. Oh, good platforming. The bane of my yeah, goddamn right. existence. Gain the flippant spell book. 
novice put, map blah, inventory blah, quest blah. Okay. Hint. Harry can move along narrow ledges and through narrow gaps. Push Harry until his back is against the wall, then move him sideways. Ooh, pushing someone until their back against the wall. You don't say. Bertie's Bots Beans are found in all kinds of places. Use them to buy things from Fred and George's shop when you get to Hogwarts. Mmm, marmalade. Oh, mmm, chocolate. Oh, sprouts. To jump Harry over gaps, run him towards the edge of them, and he will automatically leap across. Well, gotta say, I love jumps whenever they're fucking just happen. Sometimes you will want to line the camera up with a jump, or quickly see what is in front of you. You can move the camera back behind you by pressing L1. Look at flavor. Mm, coffee. Wait, really? You're a kid. You're like 11 or 12. You like coffee? Ugh, tripe. That's a fucking fish, isn't it? Over here, Mr. Potter. Yeah, shove it. Don't care. Can I go first person? Yes, I can. No, I can't. Yes, I can. No, I can't. Yes, I can. There we go. Let's see. Anything useful down there? Man. Chocolate. Oh, sprouts. Ugh. Rim. Mm. Peppermint. Mmm. Spinach flavor. Oh. Go get, get the fuck up. Spinach. Fishy. Sardine flavor. Oh. Dude, fuck you, Harry. Down here now. Harry can climb up and down. Slutters press X button to make him grab one. Curry. No, curry should not have gotten an M. Mm, that is gross. Cur well, curry's delicious. Curry flavored jelly beans, not so delicious. There we go. Spin Vomit flavor. Points to anybody that knows what vomit flavor jelly beans are really flavored after in real life. Perry. No, fuck you! See, that's what I don't like about games that don't have a jump button. That instead, you just have to, you know, jump towards your legs. Give me one sec, I got a phone call. We're back. Sorry about that. Uh, yeah. Come on. Bam! 
man? What, what, you got your fucking calf clipped? Dude, Harry's hitbox is fucking massive. Okay, so we're gonna walk real slowly so we don't fuck this jump up again. Jesus Christ. Fishy booger flavor. <sighs> Yes, indeed. Oh, very good. Well done, Mr. Potter. You survived my obstacle course. Once you learn some more powerful magic, you'll be able to cast more powerful flippendo knockback jinxes. Let me show you. We have a new spell, flippendo. Flippendo? You can assign it to square, triangle, circle by pressing the buttons now. Spells or equipments can also be assigned in your inventory screen. La 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 la. This knockback jinx is the most utilitarian of spells in that it will knock, will allow the caster to knock back an opponent or object and can also be used to push or activate certain magical charms. Switches, like many spells, flipping can be targeted using R1. Uh, fucking, we'll do square. If you'd kindly follow me. Certain objects, such as glass jars, can be smashed by using most really smooth to do. Certain objects can be. Oh, bogey! Smash some objects to find your way out. Oh, bogey! There are many chests hidden around Hogwarts. Search them to find items you might need on your adventure. Keep an eye out for the golden chests, as these contain more valuable rewards. Da 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 da. A wizard card. Technically, you don't know what those are yet. Felix Summerby, fourteen forty-seven to fifteen o eight. Inventor of cheering charms. That's right, Harry. You're not locked in here with me! These three large shields on the far wall can be flipped using your flippendo knockback jinx. Flip them in the correct order. 
Do 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 do. If more targets are nearby, you can cycle through them by quickly pressing the target button again. Uh, blah blah. can see more of the world when he's holding down R2. You can make him look around, moving the left analog stick. Target object for blah 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 there. You guys really could have made a better targeting system. Before continuing, it may be wise to collect the folio bruti. This is the folio bruti, the book of beasts. This book shows the names and appearances of each beast you may encounter in your adventures. The folio bruti will teach you their strengths and weaknesses. Imps, imp is sometimes confused with the pixies. They are of similar height. Both have a slapstick sense of humor. Imps are vicious looking creatures. You will need to use the window to knock them back before picking them up and throwing them into a hole, like a gnome, or into an open cage. And then... Excuse me, Professor, you or uh, blood to your face, you have some infestations. This can be a nuisance. Try knocking them over with flipendo. Then pick them up and lock them in the cages. Ow. Well go fuck yourself. Kindly follow me. What's that groaning wood noise? Oh, of course. It's a magical fucking windmill. To learn how to cast a spell while moving. You need to target the shear on this device and continue to cast Flipendo at it until the central section locks into place. Uh, while holding down the targeting button, press the left analog stick allows you to move around the target. Try and keep up, Mr. Potter. You must keep the shield up. Well done, Mr. Potter. Fucking... Fucking asshole! Fuck you! That's okay. Just shove that up my ass, why don't you, Potter? With the knowledge contained in this book, you'll be able to cast more powerful spells. Here's a helpful hint from the book just for you. Build up the power on your wand, but be careful. Don't overpower your spells, or you could end up in a spot of trouble. This 
time, I'd like you to power up the Flipendo spell before casting it. Like this. Flipendo! Blizzard cards to be collected and traded and increase your stamina bar by filling pages in your book. Okay. Godric Gryffindor. Medieval dates unknown. Co-founder of Hogwarts. Gave his name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. If you'd kindly follow me. <laughs> This way. Hey, Harry. Happy birthday, Harry. She's beautiful. What's her name? Her name's Hedwig, and she's yours to keep. I forgot Thanks, that he gave Hagrid. her Hedwig. We best be going now. The Hogwarts Express is leaving very soon, and you don't want to miss it. I mean, I've. Let's see. I know he misses it in the second book. I feel like he misses it more right times than he actually gets to ride on. Stopped. They followed Hagrid down to the edge of a great black lake. The fleet of little boats moved off all at once, gliding across the lake, which was as smooth as glass. Everyone was silent until. Ooh. Oh, wicked! Holy one, shit! Each of the first years was sorted into his or her house. And what of Harry Potter? Not Slytherin. Not Slytherin. Not Slytherin, eh? Are you sure? Are you sure? You could you be great. Rent, you know. It's all here in your head. No? Well, if you're sure, better be Gryffindor. Hey, Harry. Hello. I'm Ron Weasley. I'm in Gryffindor, too. It's no surprise, really. All my brothers are in Gryffindor. So, why do you think Professor Dumbledore put the third for House of Bounds? I really don't know. Come on, we've got to follow that prefect. It's odd, because he usually gives us a reason why we're not allowed to go somewhere. I do think he might have told us prefects at least. That prefect's Percy, my other brother. How many brothers have you got? Too many. My name's Hermione Granger, by the way. And you are? Uh, Ron. Ron Weasley. Pleasure. You've got something on your nose. You huh? must be Harry Potter. I know all about you, of course. Look out! Filch is coming! We'd better go! Oh, Percy. You turned out to be such a bitch. Gryffindors, follow me, please. Keep up. Harry, we'd better follow Percy up to the Gryffindor common room. Keep up, please, and follow me. Quickly now, come on. Nah. Fuck it. Let's see what else there is to do. Shit, am I gonna get my fucking health back? Kitchen? No? No? Kitchen? Okay. Nope, not there. Let's see, let's see. Great hall. Nope, thank you. Giant ass hourglasses for the houses. Nope, can't go there. Broom cupboard. Into the dungeons. Where Slytherin are. And technically, uh. 
fucking what's their names? Uh, blah 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 blah. Hufflepuff. God, I hate how he runs. I must go to the common room. Yeah, you must shove it, Harry. Hmm. Clear locked. Most direct path to the dormitory. Oh, and keep an eye on the staircases, they like to change. Meh. Okay. Come on, Harry, get to the common room. Hello, Harry. I'm so glad I got sorted into Gryffindor like my brothers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am I am not a big fan of the Harry Potter house s systems. Look at that fucking face! Like he just shit himself or something. Follow me, everyone. Keep up. Nah, I'm good. There's a chest to open. A wizard card. Cassandra Vablatsky, 1894 to 1997. Celebrated seer and author of Unfogging the Future. Now, come on. Peeves, a poltergeist. <laughs> Ooh, ickle firsties. What fun. Go away, Peeves, or the Baron will hear about this. I mean it. Do they ever talk about any kind of magic that can fuck up ghosts? You want to watch out for Peeves. The bloody Baron's the only one who can control him. He won't even listen to us prefects. Of course not. You're assholes. No one should listen to you. Keep up, please, and follow me. Quickly now, come on. What floor is this? Oh, ancient ruins. The ruins. We are we going? Arithmancy. Isn't that like magic and air or something? Follow me, everyone. Keep up. Is this game auto save. Classroom 7C. Classroom 7B. 7A. Nope. Nothing? Nothing. I guess this door is nothing. All the other doors have had names. Harry, why is your wand Gather blown? around here. Password? You need a password to enter the common room. This year, it's Caput Draconis. Caput Put Draconis. Draconis. Well done, young Gryffindor. That is indeed the correct <gasps> password. Thank 
Thanks, Harry. Just gonna leave me out here. Password. Password. Caput Draconis. Well done, young Gryffindor. That is indeed the correct password. And Joe just set up a shop. You can trade all kinds of things with them. The spells are really wicked stuff. Wow, I must go and see them. Where are they? Go through that door and through the reading room. There's a portrait on the other side. What's the password? Pig snout. <coughs> oh, and watch out for Percy. He hates being disturbed when he's studying. You'll need to stay out of his way. If you're careful, you should be able to creep past him. Visit Fred and George. Wait, fuck. Nope, not where I wanted to go. I really must go and see Fred and George. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shove it. Caput Draconis. You really should go and see Fred and George, Harry. They've got some brilliant stuff to trade. To sneak, press forward gently on the left analog stick. Through the low profile, you can sneak by pressing Harry up against the wall, peek around corners using left analog stick. You can also cast a spell while peeking. Snout. Crawl in quickly. Fuck you, Percy. You're twat. Hello, Harry. We were wondering when you'd turn up. Welcome to our shop. Feel free to browse our extensive range of wizard wheezes and magical merchandise. Everything priced at reasonable rates in the only currency universally accepted throughout Hogwarts. Bertie bots every flavor beans. And, as a special bonus, for just 10 beans, you can have a dip into this chest and receive a special prize. Ooh. Wow, I've got to try this. It sounds like fun, yes. But then, you haven't put your hand in yet. Have a good look around, Harry. And if you want to buy anything, just ask. How much is the Edgar Struger card? It'll cost 30 beans. 30 beans? You gotta fuck yourself. The limited edition Bertie Bot card. What does that cost? It'll cost 50 beans. Oh, that's expensive. I'm actually... It's like... How much is this Bertie Bot's bean carrying bag? It'll cost 50 beans. A wizard card! Chauncey Oldridge, 1342-1379, first known victim of dragon pox. 37 years old, very sad. Do I need to buy... Dung bombs? How much are they? It'll cost 20 beans. You can use dung bombs to play some great pranks. Just make sure you get out of the way before they explode. Albert Grunion. The inventor of the dung bomb. How much is that? It'll cost 30 beans. How much is a pack of stink pellets? It'll cost 20 beans. Stink pellets are a great way to stop prefects catching you. But I didn't tell you that, did I? What's dung good? bombs! There we go. That's a steal right there. And one more time. Chocolate frog, get my stamina back. Eh, fuck it. Useless chocolate frog, already have my stamina back. 
Eh, one more time. Useless fucking frog. God, good thing I suck. Be careful, Harry. Filch is not far away. He never is, is he? Can't go that way, so it's back this way we go. You can come back as often as you like, Harry. We'll be here. Come here. Nope. Hey. I must be hearing things. You must, you idiot. Okay, Harry, it's been a long day. I'm really tired, and I'm off to bed. <clears throat> Booger flavor. Give me something good. A wizard card. Ad Albert Waffling, 1899 to 1981, famous magical theoretician. Mm, toast. That is no. That is not a mmm. Toast should not be a mmm flavored bean. Will you lock onto that jar, please? Revolt spinach flavor. Now give me a say, please. Hint: When you have completed all your tasks for one day, you will be given the option to end day in your removal. At this point, you can continue to explore the world, or you can decide to end day, night, the next day is going to begin. Uh... Is there anything in here worth getting? Doesn't here. I'm turning in, Harry. There's nothing more to do. Well, if you say so. How do I end it? How do I end the day? Oh, are you safe? Any time? Uh, no Harry Potter exists. Let's do it. Let's save. Okay. I'm turning in, Harry. There's nothing more to do. How do I end the day?
requests. Harry can now move the uh, bubble beans. Certain objects, keep a lookout. There are many chests. Sneak. Hold him down. Put your friend George. I did that. Spell books for the papa. How do I end the day? There's nothing more we can do. I'm turning in. That's what I want to do. Run, you asshole! I'm sure you'll get caught by Percy. Eat a dick. Hey. Wow, well, hey. you. You really Take suck, Percy. Huh? Come here. No, oh, why and what made you a perfect? Frog? Bombs. Ah, dumb bombs. Uh... Okay, I'll fucking figure out how to progress the goddamn game next time. Thanks everyone for stopping by. Hope you guys are having a great day.